to my channel. So I thought I would share with you guys a long awaited video. I feel so bad that it's taking me so long to film this and I'm finally getting around to it. But this is a candle haul that I did from my friend Tina. She has a, her own business. It's a candle company. She makes all of the candles herself. And I have wanted to place an order from her for so long since she started the candle business. And I never got around to doing it for one reason or another. And so I just wanted to be able to uh, support her and her endeavors. And her candles honestly looked amazing. So I did place a small candle order. And I wanted to share that with you guys. I'm super excited. I know my friend Beth also ordered from her candle uh, line or candle business. And um, she's shared that on her channel as well. Um, which I will try to find and link it down below for you guys. I ordered this back in October. It didn't take fairly long. I think it was pretty decent. Um, and then inside it has a little thank you for your purchase card from our small business. It means a road to us and helps makes us grow. She did give me a discount code that you could use 10% off. Um, so I will link um, her website and all the information that you would need down below as well as that uh, code for you guys. And then another little um, card that just talks about how to care for the candles and things like that. Um, so that's really nice. It give you some little tips and tricks. So it says to burn at least for two hours. Um, cut the wick every time. Never leave it unattended of course. Uh, no longer than four hours at a time and stop using when it's less than one and a half wax remaining at the bottom. So that's nice. It just has uh, some detailed information, which is great. Um, so I usually do cut my wick every time um, I burn again. So I appreciate that because some people don't know. First candle that I ordered, and I had ordered these back in October right for fall. But the first one, this is her packaging. I think it's very sleek and very nice. It has her business name. The boxes are black. Underneath it tells you the fragrance. Um, this one is Fire Roasted Marshmallow. Now, if you guys have been with me for some time, you know that one of my favorite fragrances ever from Bath & Body is Marshmallow Fireside. And that is why I wanted to try this one. And she does have some little frillies in here and all of that to keep it packaged nicely. We're just going to pull that out. Uh -oh. It smells good from what I could smell so far. Yeah, it smells really, really nice. And this is what it looks like. Obviously, it's just a standard candle. It's a two wick. It's very uh, heavy filling. It doesn't feel cheap or anything. It feels really nice quality. That is the label there. And when I saw this, I was like, perfect. I wanted to order way before fall, but I ended up waiting because I knew she was coming out with some more fall scents and I was waiting for them to restock. But this one is a nine ounce and it smells so good. I'm almost done with one in my living room now and I'm going to put this aside so I can burn this one next. But this is one of my absolute favorite scents. And then the next one I got was Sweater Days. And there is one from Bath & Body that I kind of just uh, accustomed it to or, or purchased this because um, the similarities. Um, and it's Sweater Weather, I think, is the one that um, Bath & Body has. But this is the packaging as well. Same style of packaging. Very nice labeling. I think she's done a great job with this. When, and they are soy candles. I don't know if I mentioned that, which is supposed to be a lot better. I did start hearing that Bath & Body candles, which I don't know, I have to research, but basically if you have infants and things like that, they give off some not good fumes that are not good for um, the babies and things like that. So it probably isn't good for us as well to be like inhaling that. So I'm going to do research, but I'm really glad these are soy. I should have ordered some extras like for family members like my mother-in-law and sister-in-law and stuff because I think these would make great gifts. But um, her, her candles are very reasonable as well. But this one smells amazing. 
I'm really excited to have that one. So, and then the other thing that I actually ordered um, were some wax melts, and it just sounded really good. It's really nice uh, and packaged very well. And this is the Texas Pecan Pie. It does say here, with peach, cinnamon, and vanilla. And that is what it looks like. It's your pretty standard wax melt right there. Let's see what this smells like. And honestly, I only got this because it had the word Texas in it because I love Texas. And, ooh, that's nice. You could really smell that vanilla and cinnamon. I can't really smell the peach. Maybe I can. Maybe that's what I'm smelling at first. Yeah. This smells to me like... There's a dessert that I've tried that smells like this. And I can't recall, but I'm really excited to try these. And I love the smell of that. I knew that I would. It's a nice smell. And then a couple of goodies, like I said, she added in here. So this one here she added, which is a gingerbread wax melt sample, and that's what it looks like. And I think he broke, unfortunately. Um, the candles were kind of on top of it, and I know that was not her fault or anything like that. Um, I'm sure it was due to the error of the of the people, the you know the uh, post office and or you know, mailer people. Oh man, that smells good. But he's in three little pieces right there. My gingerbread broke. <laughs> you can see him right there. I'm still going to use it because you have to break them down anyways. But oh my gosh, if I can get this in a candle or more of these little shaped ones, I would definitely get some because that's super cute. I love gingerbread. I don't know if anybody knows that, but I do love gingerbread. I love gingerbread cookies. I love gingerbread drinks. So yeah, thank you so much for that, Tina. I'm going to be checking that out on your site in a candle because that smells amazing. And then some non-candle little goodies that she added in here, which was very sweet. Yeah, she sent me this pin right here. Look how pretty that is. Um, it's a pretty purpley lavender shade. Love that. I always need things like this for my purse and stuff. So glad to have that. And then she sent a little matching notepad. This is super cute. And I love the size of it because I can toss it in my purse. I've been needing something like this in my purse lately. So this is going to come in handy. I've been having to just take big pieces of paper because I don't have anything that size. I have everything that's bigger than that and it doesn't fit in my purse very well. And then the last little goodies she sent right here are in this little bag. And these are two little Swedish fish. And these I really do like. These are yummy, and that was very sweet of her to just to throw these little guys in. Sometimes I just have a taste for something sweet at night, and gum, and I love gummy kind of candies, so these will come in handy. So thank you for that. And these items, Tina, I really do appreciate it. I definitely needed these. But like I said, guys, I could smell the candles so strong right now. They smell amazing. Um, all of her info will be linked down below her website. Um, the coupon code that she put on there, I'll get uh, put it down there for you guys so you can use it as well. Definitely check her out. Again, she is a small business, and I definitely have truly enjoyed supporting small businesses um, like her and ones around town that I live. I've been trying to do that a lot more um, because ever since COVID, I didn't really... Um, do that a whole lot but ever since COVID did happen I realized that a lot of people um, did lose their businesses and I my heart went out to them and so I try now if I can um, to support those smaller businesses before I do the other places so all of her info will be linked down below I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you enjoy candles definitely check her out she also has a YouTube channel which I will also link down below if you want to check her out she does amazing eye looks um, she did used to get BoxyCharm. I don't think she does anymore, but she does a lot of great videos on her channel. So definitely check her out. Um, but this is going to complete this video for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I do appreciate each and every one of you guys, and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.